So I'm sitting here reading and earlier I shut the closet doors so you can see they're shut. But I'm hearing scratching and I'm freaked right out and the dog took off out of the room. Is, guys, it's your boy Blast Miss HD, and today we're here to do a try not to get scared challenge. Now I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. We gonna be real right now. I'm not good at these. I'm naturally scary off general principle. So I've got my nunchucks with me so that I can at least feel powerful enough not to be scared. I thought that was gonna be the case. Last video proved it wrong, but we back. Let's do this. Top 10 ghosts, caught on camera, light and shadow. Oh, hell no. Gavin Lloyd was alone in his basement, attempting to record a video of the new lighting that he had installed to show his friend. Later, when he looked back at his footage, he discovered that he had captured more than just his lights. So I got these new lights to put in our basement. I got them at Walmart the other day. Here's a blue one. Oh, no, no, ah! Ah! So there's that one, and then- I don't do this. Over here. I don't do none of this. There's a blue one. I don't do or a this. red one, I mean. I don't do none of this, baby. What's all this? That's What's happening? Looks. I don't see nothing. It really looks cool. Where's it at? There's that one. And then. Oh, that's not good. He ain't paying Over no here. rent. A shadow figure seems to be standing motionless in the corner of his basement. But just moments later, as he pans his camera back to the same corner, nothing there. Oh, hell no. So is this a ghost accidentally caught on camera or just a trick of the light? Oh boy. A step too far. This next strange video was filmed at an allegedly haunted house in Salt Lake City, Utah. Yeah, it better not be the woman alleged. who lived in the home claimed that she had seen and heard some truly unexplainable things. Yeah, so baby. her son decided to spend the night in the house to try to capture the activity with his infrared camera. Even her own baby don't want to live footage, there. He found something truly bizarre. No, I don't do this. I don't do this. I don't do this. Okay, everybody. Hold still for a second. Ah! Shit, Hello? my heart! My heart hurts! Oh, God. Oh, the that strange hurts. white shape of what almost looks like a child seems to walk from left to right oh, at the top of the stairs. He oh. says that he didn't see the odd figure at all until he played the footage back later. That's so a whole a ghost, ghost child! On camera? Or just an elaborate hoax. No, you decide. The girl in the woods. Nope. Italian YouTube channel PIT Paranormal Investigation Team are investigating an allegedly haunted forest in the remote Italian countryside. They believe that the ghost of a little girl named Matilda haunts these woods. A local hunter claims that he saw the terrifying apparition and that the little girl ghost appeared to be covered in dark bruises oh, from no. head to toe. Nope. They soon locate the area where the hunter encountered the girl. Absolutely and two not. PIT team members spot something. Nope. No. Okay. It's shaking. Ma lei non era nel sentiero. But she wasn't on the path. Sicuro. Lui avrà puntato da qualche parte per tenere d'occhio qualcosa, come se fossimo noi qua. No, la luce. Raga, ma di nuovo, ma te lo giuro. Ma te lo giuro. Ma te lo giuro. Ma, te lo giuro. ma grossa così. Fascio di luce. Where is it? Big foot? Luce, ma bianco, ma. Io ero oh, white people like this alien. Forse ce l'ho in camera. It's a UFO, baby. We got aliens, man. Con dei brividi. Goosebumps. You don't read books. Shut up, bitch. What's that? They hear the unexplained sounds of twigs breaking and rustling bushes all around them, oh, seemingly no. leading them somewhere. Oh no! That's oh, when they find their long abandoned house, Us! far away from any pass, completely Blue hidden by vegetation. Blue they start it. asking questions, and team member Debbie gets an answer. Yeah, like where's the closest bus stop? Can you let us know you're here? Hey, down, down! Hey, look, don't tell us nothing. I don't want to Guys, what? What's going on? Cosa? Raga, raga. What's going on? I don't get it. Have you heard it? No. Hear that? What? Hear what? The sound of your breasts. Ora ascoltiamolo, eh. Pull your titties out. Ascoltiamolo. Cosa? Show your pussy, bitch. Cosa hai sentito? Non vorrei sbagliare. Show your titties, bitch. Ma mi è sembrato di sentire. Pull out your titties, me. Non piangere. 
Please pull out your brand. This isn't sexist. Raga. Yeah. That's because. Raga. Yaga. Raga. Matilde stai piangendo. The team no longer feels like they are alone in the woods. They try to communicate with the ghost of the little girl, attempting to convince her to show herself. And this is when things get truly chilling. Man, I don't believe this. Te lo richiedo un'altra volta. I'm asking you once again. Perché non ci Show us your titty meat. Pull Dove out your titty. con te, possiamo Big stare da soli con te. Nobody count. Un posto magari più appartato. Shh. Doggy style, anytime. The doggy style. Di nuovo con lì prima. Che roba era? Hey, si muove dietro di te. Ah, ok. Tu ci butta, bitch, no. Ask questions. Vedi qualcosa? Ma ragazzi, ho sentito rumore, eh. Di passi. Man, man, ain't nobody up in there. What happened? Sound effects. Ominousness. Noi non siamo mica venuti qua per farti del male o per crearti dei problemi. Anzi, te l'ho già detto. Yeah, I don't think that goes both ways, brother. Possiamo yeah, giocare con down, te baby. Possiamo Darti delle caramelle One of the cameramen These ghost investigators is a group of whole predators They're gonna offer the little girl candy Possiamo giocare con te Possiamo Darti delle caramelle let it that out. And falls on his back as he captures what looks like a little girl standing alone in the abandoned woods. They check the area, but can't find anyone. Or anything. Well, you got your answer? Non è possibile, non è possibile, non è possibile. Oh no, I heard that, that cry. Oh. Non c'è niente qua. Non c'è niente. So, is the ghost of a little girl with a tragic past still wandering around her old house? Or is it something else? Lights out. Musician Aiden Ayers often uploads comedic sketches and videos to the popular app TikTok. However, these next two videos are very different from his usual posts. You see, Aiden claims that his house is haunted. Watch. You see that? Oh no! Oh no! What the f oh no! No, 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 no! No! What the There's somebody there, bro. Me, I'm not a Don't play, crap, man. Quit playing. Hell no. Don't get closer, nigga. What the f? Dude, I'm out of here. Hell no, bro. Oh, what it's the closer. F oh, f it's that. moving. Every time Aiden turns off the lights, the shadowy figure of a girl wearing a dress can be seen standing in his room. She then comes closer and closer until she gets just a bit too close and Aiden runs. Now it definitely bears mentioning that this video is very similar to the popular viral short film and movie Lights Out. So is it a ghost or just another creepy TikTok hoax? No, this, is, this, ain't, this, ain't, this ain't fake. Did you see it? Reddit God, user Chris it. and in this bizarre video that his sister captured at his grandmother's house. Chris says that his grandma often complained that the ghosts of two children haunted her home. A young girl named Sally and a little boy named Thomas. Visitors to the house would often experience objects being moved on their own or be awakened in the middle of the night by strange sounds. Creepiest of all, Chris's grandmother claimed that the two child ghosts were scared of the sinister spirit of an older man that also haunted the house. So one night Chris's sister decided to sleep over at his grandmother's house. She says that around 4 a.m. she woke up to the feeling of being watched. Remembering her grandmother's creepy stories, she got out of bed to check around the house, recording everything. Oh, what the? Oh. Oh. Did you see it? Oh. For some reason, a small oval picture frame is gently rocking back and forth on the wall. Not only that, but Chris and some Reddit commenters believe that in the reflection of the picture frame, you can see the face of a man with a beard. Yo, that's... They say he's wearing sunglasses, or some even say he has no eyes at all. That's Santa Claus! So... Could this be the mysterious male spirit that the ghost children are scared of? Or 
Is it simply an optical illusion? It certainly could just be pareidolia, but I think I actually see what looks like a face. Yeah. But what do you see? Let me know in the comments. The ghost of Christmas Eve. School's out. The ghost Two of Peruvian Christmas students Claus. are hanging out at their school after dark. They what? record the school grounds as they explore and joke around with each other. But something truly chilling catches their attention. Oh, this friend sounds like Speedy Gonzalez. Oh, vamos a ver, mierda. Concha tu madre, se abrió la puerta, weón. No. Oh, weón, corre, corre. ¿Qué fue eso? Corre, weón, corre. Oh, Yara. Oh, corre. Oh, did they make it out? Hey, Lucho. Did we make it out? Lucho, no, Lucho. Bro, Lucho, bro. The lights turn on and off, doors open on their own, and chairs are being thrown all around. After this terrifying experience, they decide to just make a run for it. YouTube user Dark Alias posted this video to his channel, and many viewers requested that he return to the school late at night no. to capture more paranormal footage. No. However, Dark Alias outright refused. He no. says he will not stay at the school after dark ever again. No. Something in the closet. Oh, damn! Kathy Not, no, Gallinger I mainly uses this. her TikTok account to upload cute videos of I her cats, her cockatiel Jasper, and her dog Lucy. Oh. But on April 22nd, she posted a disturbing video about the closet in her bedroom. Okay, guys, I heard a noise coming from my bedroom again. Guys, so I came in my room, heard a noise in the closet again. Closet's open. The dog hasn't left. Let's see what you hear. Okay guys, so I heard a noise in my room. The dog is sitting in front of the closet that I believe is haunted because I always hear noises. And look at this, the closet is open again. Okay, so there was like a scratching noise and the dog took off. Um, <clears throat> There is absolutely nothing, nothing. There is never anything in our closet. Kathy sets up an infrared camera to record overnight to try and capture the closet doors moving on their own. So I'm sitting here reading and earlier I shut the closet doors so you can see they're shut. But I'm hearing scratching and I'm freaked right out and the dog took off out of the room. Bro, I hit myself with the nunchucks, nigga. I can't do this. I ain't about this life. Ah! Oh, my thumb. Invisible friend. YouTube ghost hunting channel, Ghost Stalkers Paranormal Investigations, say that their house is haunted by the ghost of a little girl named Anna. One day, they were filming their youngest son playing, and they captured some creepy footage completely by accident.
Did you see it? No. When slowed down, you can see what appears to be a small translucent figure running by at superhuman uh. speed. The paranormal investigators believe that this is the child ghost that haunts their home playing with their son. But what do you think? Attic panic. In a recent investigation Ooh. by YouTube Ghost Hunters Mindseed TV, paranormal investigators Casey Nolan and Tanner McBride traveled to an Ooh. old abandoned mansion in South Alabama. The estate dates back to the early 1800s, and local townspeople claim that the house is extremely haunted. It is said that the unexplained screams of a woman can be heard coming from the empty home at all hours of the night. The last known family to reside in the house was a newlywed couple and their two young daughters. The family tragically lost their lives in a fatal car accident. As Casey and Tanner investigate, things start to get a little weird. This, yeah, I'm in a stairwell right now, actually. You said you, you got an attic? Hey, hold on, hold on, shh. What the f What are we doing? What What's the going on, is baby? That? Dude, hold on. What's going on? What are we doing? What is that? What the f is that? What the f? No! 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 no. no. Get my hand on my balls! Keep it's your a hand. record player. Keep your hand on your balls, man! I'd have broke that. Yeah! Yeah, how did this just turn on? What? But the two ghost hunters were capturing even more terrifying paranormal activity that they didn't even notice. Because something seems to be creeping around the house as they investigate. What's that? I saw the reflection of your uh, flashlight in the mirror in the front. Yeah. It made it look like somebody with a flashlight was on the other side of the roof. There's movement in an empty hall closet. Oh, okay. But Casey says that he only noticed it later while reviewing his footage. But there's more. Oh. Watch closely as Casey notices strange handprints on one of the windows. Warren, dude, it's like a monsoon. My hand feel better now. Oh, is that little handprints on the window? Oh no. Dude, it's like yeah. little, like oh, little finger drags. Oh no. That's weird. See that? Yeah. Did you see it? Casey doesn't notice, but it seems like a small, pale hand can be seen reaching up to claw at the window. Oh! Oh! Oh, is there little handprints on the window? Casey and Tanner head upstairs to investigate, and this is when things get truly bizarre. Does it sound like, oh my, do you hear that? That sounds like and my flashlight just fucking died. In the attic. Don't do it. What? Don't you do it. The f God damn it, my flashlight won't turn on. Don't you do it. What the f Get out of there. They hear someone walking across the attic floor. So they head up into the what? attic to check it out. What? But they find that the attic doesn't even have a floor for someone to have been walking on. What? Just a series of wooden beams and a few planks spread across them. So just what could the odd footstep sounds have been? There's no time to consider the matter as Casey and Tanner hear something else in the oh, dark no. attic. Oh no! Hey. Yeah. Is that a cat? Is that a cat? Whimpering! No! 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 Turn on your lights! What is that? All of the lights. Let's get out of here. Run yeah, away! Yeah, let's, yeah, let's get out of Run here. Run away! And with that, the guys just decide to make a quick exit from the creepy attic. Yep, I'm not doing it. You can watch this full investigation of the creepy Alabama mansion 
and the second part titled Haunted Mansion Part 2 over on the Mind it. Seed TV YouTube channel. I ain't doing it, baby. In midair. What? TikTok user Mama Dab shared a strange video that had paranormal believers and skeptics arguing over its authenticity. Oh hell no. That's not a reverse video? Now skeptics say that the video is in reverse or that the balloon is attached to a wire. So Mama Dab uploaded another video to try to prove to skeptical viewers that the paranormal activity is real. Here you go everyone. No visual effects, no audio, just straight video. Send it down, Steven. Send it back. There we go. Thank you. What? <laughs> now, this could just be some sort of trick using fans or wires, but these popular videos have been suggested in my email so many times that I just had to give it a spot in the list. Whether it's real or just a hoax, I'll leave that for you to decide. Curse of Hell's Bar Dam. The Hell's Bar Dam, located on the Tennessee River in Helltown, Tennessee, was built in 1913 on former Native American land that is supposedly cursed. The dam is often called the most haunted dam in the world, and it has a very dark history. During the construction of the Hell's Bar Dam, hundreds of workers lost their lives in workplace accidents. Then, soon after the dam's completion, it began to spring leaks on a weekly basis. Under the dam, there was a narrow tunnel used by local children to get across the river to school. One fateful day, a sudden massive leak caused the tunnel to flood, trapping many of the school children inside. Records of the event are sketchy, but it is believed that at least two of the children lost their lives in the flood. Eventually, it was found that the ground the dam was built on was unstable. So a new dam was built further downstream and the old Hell's Bar Dam was abandoned. In a two-part investigation, YouTube ghost hunter Franco TV explores the cursed grounds of the haunted dam. As he walks through the abandoned underground tunnel, things start to get a little strange. No, no, no children, no happy children's laughter. What's that? I'm not afraid to say this, but I am honestly afraid right now. Later, as a heavy storm rolls in, Frank continues his exploration in a different part of the Hales Bar Dam. Frank sets up a spirit box in a decaying room, but he catches something on camera that he never expected. Is it okay that I could record in this room? Yeah, sure. I don't know if that's what it said. You guys correct me. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. My pants are black. It almost looks like the shape of a face is peeking in the window. Franco TV later finds out that he caught another unexpected surprise on camera. And 
YouTuber Syntax77 is a backpacker and outdoorsman who posts accounts of his adventures while hiking deep in the secluded woods and mountains. In his videos, he gives camping and hiking advice, and also tests out gear as he camps out overnight in the middle of nowhere. None of his videos are about anything related to the paranormal. However, in one video uploaded on June 2nd, 2019, YouTube viewers noticed something truly bizarre. After a long hike alone on the Kahana Trail in Pennsylvania, Syntax 77 sets up camp right next to the ruins of what was once an old farmhouse. As he starts eating his dinner for the night, this happens. Man, that's good. A little bit of a gravy in there. I'm happy. I hear Calm, that. peaceful. A little breeze through the uh, treetops, but nothing too bad yet. YouTube commenters believe that a voice can be heard saying, be quiet, stay silent. I'll boost the audio, listen again. I'm happy. It's calm, peaceful, a little breeze through the uh, treetops, but nothing too bad yet. Oh! Syntax 77 spends the night in a hammock right beside the creepy farmhouse ruins. The next morning, he packs his things and starts to head back. And it seems that something is very eager to see him go. That's the trees we had to set up on. This is the other foundation here. Cool little spot for sure. But uh, time to move on. You can see, I don't know if you can see, but... Right as Syntax 77 walks by the ruins of the old farmhouse, a bizarre voice can be heard whispering, Get out. But, uh, time to move on. You can see, I don't know if you can't see, but... Oh, so, bugger. is this the ghost of the former farmhouse owner demanding that he leave? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? Oh boy. To this day, Syntax 77 has not responded to any comments regarding the EVPs. He still actively posts hiking and camping videos to his YouTube channel, but nothing supernatural. The Road to Ruin These next two scary videos were captured on a secluded forest road near Mexico City named the Desierto de las Leones, or in English, the Lion's Desert Road. The local townspeople tell ghost stories of strange dark figures running across the road late at night, causing motorists to swerve off the road and crash. These unexplained incidents are said to be especially common around the 31 kilometer mark on the road. The uninhabited buildings along the roadside are also said to be haunted by these roaming spirits or entities. On the Mexican YouTube channel Terror Alex Stramo, a team of urban explorers travel to the allegedly haunted road to see if the stories are true. Bueno, pues vamos grabando un poco del recorrido. Que les repito, la gente dice que se aparecen fantasmas y se les avientan a los vehículos. ¡Aco, güey! ¡Cabrón! ¡Uy, güey! ¿Qué the hell? What's going on? What's going on? Don't open the door. Something seems to hit their truck, but when they check, there's nothing there. So they continue driving down the creepy road. No. Again, something hits the truck, but they can't find the source. They decide to take a short break on the side of the road. Without even knowing it at the time, they capture something on camera that is downright chilling. No, vintes. Se siente bastante el frío por aquí. Did you see it? As they're sitting in their truck, a strange figure seems to run towards the empty park building at the top of the hill. 
Now there are no other cars around, so that leaves the question, just who or what was this mysterious figure and why were they running around in the woods in the middle of the night? The urban explorers continue down the road and find one of the allegedly haunted buildings. Again, they don't seem to be alone. Avienta toda tu luz. Al cien. Porque como está bien oscuro. Sí, ya se ve mejor. Uy, no puede ser, Luis. ¿Qué? Luis, alguien se acaba de asomar ahí de esa ventana. No manches, neta. Sí, güey. Don't you do this. Aquí, aquí, aquí. Te lo juro aquí. Alguien se nos estaba viendo hacia allá, güey. Le puedo ver la mitad del torso. No inventes, neta. Sí, claro. Híjoles. But it gets even weirder. As they search the area around the building, things take a chilling turn. Como ves si... Cuidado, cuidado, ¿estás bien? ¿Qué fue? ¿Es una niña? ¿Como de una niña? Now, Alberto and his cameraman didn't notice it at the time, but a dark shape can be seen moving in the left window of the same empty stone house where the other team saw the same figure. So did YouTube channels Terra del Extremo and Alberto Del Arco capture evidence of the Lions Desert Road being haunted by yes. sinister spirits? Yep. You decide. Check out their channels to see more shocking footage that they captured during their investigations. Meanwhile, on TikTok. TikTok user Josiah Worley isn't shy when it comes to his drinking habits. He often gets extremely intoxicated and uploads multiple videos to TikTok. Now, the subject of his videos has caught a lot of viewers' attention. Josiah believes that his house might be haunted and records the almost daily paranormal activity. Am I tripping? Am I tripping? Do you see that? Oh, oh my oh. God. Okay. Can you not do that, please? Yeah, I'm leaving. Oh! Here are my hands. Did you see that? Did you see that? Here are my feet not moving. Here are my hands and my feet. Mom? No. No. No way. As you can see, I put it back on this thing. I'm about to go lay back down and I'm gonna hope to God that nothing f***ing does any weird because I feel like there's weird right there. But at the same time, it could be friendly. Oh God, now look at me. I'm starting to sound like a f***ing weirdo. You got weirdos and shit like that? I'm gonna take another shot. Hold on. Okay, move that. Do you see that? What? Saw that. You're I don't know what to do. I'm also scared to show you guys my face because I look pretty ugly, but here you go. Yo, YOLO. What's good, bro? Bro. Bro. Are you good, bro? You good, bro? Do you see any strings? Did you guys see it move? And just two days later, it happens again. So for like a whole day, nothing has been going down. And then this can happens. Okay, there's nothing. <clears throat> I even brought over somebody. They're I don't know why the she's fast asleep. I've been drinking a little bit. Maybe it's only when I get drunk. But regardless, dude, that's really up. You shouldn't be doing that. You shouldn't be doing that. You should not. You should not be doing that. Please stop doing that, okay? Okay, stay there. Be chill. Stop for a minute. Wow. 
I'm gonna leave. <laughs> sorry, but I'm gonna leave. I'm really sorry for that. Is that at least um, a female? <clears throat> that light shut off. There's a switch right there. It got switched off. Turning off this light. F it. So I ended up taking a trip to Walmart because can't really handle. Can't really handle what's happening. Josiah decides to take a trip to a department store to get a break from the constant strange activity. But when he returns, it only seems to get worse. I've been cleaning up since I woke up, okay? And I've been hearing a lot of weird but for some reason, whenever I pull my camera out, it stops. But that didn't stop, did it? What the was it? What was it? I was laying in bed watching some guy. This turned off, and I went to go grab a drink. And for some, fucking, are you fucking joking? Can you please fucking stop? Do you see? This is starting to get more fucking sketched out. Actually, to be honest with you, like I'm starting to get more scared. Like, uh, as we go along. Uh, the bizarre occurrences are even witnessed by his friends. I really wish I recorded it. That thing fell over twice. Two times, not once. Twice. And this mother I just picked it up. This mother over here is acting like nothing ever happened. It's a man Don't thing. Imagine it <laughs> if it didn't happen, it's it didn't a man, happen, it's a guy huh? thing. Look okay, away. well, we're about to fucking leave. <laughs> <laughs> But then the paranormal activity in his home just becomes a little too extreme for Josiah. I, I don't know if I'm even recording. I don't know if I'm okay with being here. Um, I'm gonna end up leaving. Damn. I'm not a bitch. At least I didn't think I was. But I'm you're not. Starting to progressively become more scared. You gotta move, bro. You gotta move, homie. It's like, oh god, you just can't really handle that. That's not real life, is it? It's not. Oh, I need to take another shot. No, dude, get out of there, bro. Now, of course, this could just be a huge TikTok hoax. No. But in that last video, Josiah certainly seemed pretty upset. Bro. But what do you think? That's sad, To follow dude. his continuing story, head over to Josiah Worley's TikTok page. TikTok user Kelsey Flynn says that a friend took her picture while she was trying on a bridesmaid's dress in a local shop. When she looks back at the picture, things get truly bizarre. I went bridesmaid shopping yesterday and I had on this dress and my sister is gonna wear this one so I took this picture and I just sent it to her this morning and she responds saying oh my god that picture is possessed this is the full photo look at my face here this is not a serious smile but look at my face here and now look at my reflection in the back mm. I'm sorry what the f what the fuck is that I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. That's possessed. That is the truth or dare smile. That where are my teeth? That's not even the same. F that is not the same smile. Is Ooh. that? I can't. Ooh. Now there's a digital camera effect called rolling shutter that can make different parts of a picture appear altered if they happen within just a fraction of a second. Like for example, spinning helicopter blades or a quick blink of the eyes. Luke Mandel submitted this photo to Boing Boing. His camera scans left to right, and in this instance, managed to capture a blink, eyes closed when the scan began, and then open in the reflection scanned a fraction of a second later. But for Kelsey's entire face and expression to change from this to this, it seems like it would take longer than just the blink of an eye. Mm. But what do you think? Is this just a digital glitch, or did Kelsey Flynn catch something paranormal in her photo? The doors strike back. Now, if you're a regular viewer of this channel, you might know Adventure Allah as the original door-kicking Saudi ghost hunter. 
But in this video, things go very differently for Allah, and his foot to door technique seems to backfire on him. So Adventure Allah is on another live stream ghost hunt, checking out an abandoned building that is said to be haunted by a jinn or evil spirit. Whoever or whatever is in the building with Allah, it seems to have malicious intent. When Allah starts his investigation, he prays, which seems to immediately trigger some strange activity. ولا يحيطون بشيء من علمه إلا بما شاء وسع كرسيه السماوات والأرض ولا يؤده حفظهما وهو العلي العظيم That ghost don't like religion Oh my foot بسم الله Oh my foot بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله بسم الله حسبي الله ونعم الوكيل yep, your God can't save you now <تصفيق> والله يا اخوان احس مني بحالي والله شوف كيف يتحرك حسبي الله ونعم الوكيل قسما بالله العظيم ان الظل ذا يتحرك الحالة This dude need friends, bro. Yeah, your chest hurts, man. You're in a haunted house and you know it. Oh, 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 oh. A loud sound startles the denture Allah and he almost falls through the weak railing to the concrete floor two stories below. Now, he decides it's time to leave. But it might be too late. Bismillah! Bismillah! Run! Allah is the Lord, 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 Yep, there you go. Ya khwan, diggo al Ahmed, bisra ya khwan. No, yeah, you, yeah, you. Bismillah, when he got out of the kebab, Rabb the kebab. Don't worry, your God's coming. He's coming. Yeah. Yep. Ask, ask your God to open the door for you. Huh? Yep. Allah, la ilaha illa huwa al Hayyu Qayyum. Yep. La taqdhu sifat wa la nawm. Oh! Yeah. Oh my God! Maybe his God did come and open the door for him. I stand corrected. Oh shit! Oh shit! What happened? Allah eventually managed to escape the terrifying experience unharmed, but was it real or just a very elaborate hoax? The hell? You decide. What happened? You ain't Check out more of Allah's creepy ghost hunts over on his YouTube channel, Adventure Allah. I might edit out that jump scare that happened in the middle of the video. People can't know. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to comment, like, and don't subscribe. This is your boy Blastmas HD. And if stuff moves in your crib, run immediately. Twisms.